Positioning of the camera. Funny. Anyways, I'm in the mall sitting down. So I got to Zara to exchange my stuff. My birthday is coming up. So I got this present. And it was a bit too big for me. So I decided to come and exchange it. And I'm just sitting here. I didn't get a chance to exchange um, both items, so I need to go to another mall where my size is. So I'm waiting on a friend of mine to drop me there. Let's see how it goes today. You guys have seen my outfit already, so I won't show you again. It's not that busy today. I like that store over there, Marshall. Yes. But yeah. So I'm just sitting here waiting. Oh, 
it's just one of those things. For some reason I'm not feeling as bright as I should feel. I feel a little bit down today. And I'm a bit tired and haven't been sleeping well. Oh. I have this project, this house project I'm doing at home and it's so stressful and sometimes I thought that this idea that when you're overseas or like when you're in a third world country the there is this general idea that if you are involved in a project with somebody from the first world country those from the third world tends to think that the one from the first world has infinite funds and they just go about um, they just go about basically not caring about where the person supplying the funds get their funds from they they just think that this is money that would never run out so they don't care about having very good work ethics they work however whenever and they expect you to just keep on paying that's been bugging me because my project is incomplete I need it to be completed I was hoping it would have been completed by Christmas it doesn't seem to be the case it started since last September so it's over a year the plan was to have it done in six months and I am just so disappointed and upset I think I made a mistake in my decision and it's something I cannot undo right now so it's like there's a term for it economically if it's already started there's nothing you can do about it the money has already been spent whatever has been spent it's gone so you therefore have to cut your losses and just do the best that you can so that's the situation I'm in right now and it's a bit stressful and I don't like it. It's stressing me out. It's giving me bigger bags under my eyes. <laughs> and I don't like it. But and just a myriad of other things that oh it's just a phase, you know, everybody goes through those phases where they're having times in their lives when it's, things are just not going as planned. But hopefully it would get better. I am positive that it would. So fingers crossed. Uh, it's just good to talk to you guys about it sometimes, you know? It's, helps ease the pain and disappointment anyhow thank you guys for spending this time with me i love you don't forget to subscribe click the subscribe button it's right there yes. and i'll see you in my next video oh my goodness I just love this bathroom. <laughs> so I'm in the bathroom at one of um, 
our malls here in Ottawa. It's Bishan, one of my favorite malls. And I just love the bathroom. So, that's my reason for taking these shots. Oh my goodness, it's just gorgeous. The stacked stainless steel, the gorgeous mirrors and lights. It's newly renovated, so I just love coming to the bathroom. And anybody who knows me very well, I love bathrooms. <laughs> I'm always in the bathroom. Just love a spa-like looking bathroom. <laughs> I ate food at Manchu Walk. Asian food and here you have oh so nice nursing room this is gorgeous wow isn't this beautiful look it's like spa like I just wanted you guys to see it's just gorgeous makes me want to have a baby <laughs> not look at this this is the nursing room I don't know what the men's section is like but this is just absolutely stunning the interior decorator did an excellent job nice pot lights in the roof look at the backsplash Wow, this is gorgeous. And of course, there is the men's section. I could only imagine what in there looks like. Can't see anything, but it seems to be the same sort of design. That's men's section. <laughs> and this is the family section where children and family can come in. Wow, this is gorgeous. It's just beauty, it's well thought out, I love it. I would love to have this designer in my house. <laughs> this is a beautiful mall. Yeah, it's a beautiful yeah. smile. <laughs> Where's the kind of coffee you want? Um, chai. You want chai tea? Oui. I don't even know.